The day of Arafah is around the corner, and I'm going to need you guys to really pay attention, because I truly believe that the super vast majority of Muslims underestimate the power of this day to completely change your life. So make sure you watch it, and you share it like wildfire. Now, of course, we know that the day of Arafah is in the first 10 days of which the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He told us the best 10 days in the entire year so much so that doing a good deed in these 10 days is better than doing a good deed outside of it. Even if you were going to go and lose all your money and even your own self, your own life for the sake of Allah. And so you can see already that these 10 days carry incredible virtue. But when it comes specifically to the day of Arafah, there's a plethora more narrations from the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that indicate how superior it is to the rest of the other nine days. So for example, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he told us that there is no day in the entire year that Allah frees people from the fire, except on the day of Arafah. Now really reflect on this narration because it's so much deeper than we think in order for us to get into Jannah. We have to be living our day-to-day -day lives a specific way so we can get that right by Allah telling you that there's no day in the entire year where people are freed from the hellfire and elevated in ranks in Jannah Allah is basically telling you that if you do the day of Arafah correctly and you make the most out of this opportunity, the entire course of the way that you live your life day to day is going to completely transform in order to get you to that final destination. Are you following? And so now we're ready to go into the first step plan, which will be enough for you, inshallah, to make the most out of this incredibly virtuous day number one. And this is probably the most important of all five, is to make a firm, solid commitment, a strong, sincere intention that you want this day to be the cause of a brand new chapter to open in your life. You know what your relationship with Allah is like. You know where your sins that you're committing are, you know, where you need to improve. And so by making this firm intention and realizing that the Prophet Allah, he said that verily actions are judged by their intentions, making that intention and doing your best on that day is going to be pivotal to transforming your life. Number two, don't underestimate the power of dua on this day. The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam he said that the best dua to make is the dua on the day of meaning. Your dua is going to be so much more significant and powerful that even the response from Allah to that dua is going to have so much more blessings within it. And so whatever it is that you want from strength to health to relationships to business, whatever it may be, spill your heart out from the most sincere place place in your heart starting with tonight whilst you're in and from there on all the way until when you're standing sitting lying down beg Allah for whatever you want and do not forget our brothers and sisters across the world going through very very severe tests right now number three is to keep your tongue moist with the remembrance of Allah in between the sessions of dua you have throughout the day and so that means saying over and over again subhanallah alhamdulillah the prophet also told us in hadith to increase specifically on the day of number four which you all know already is to make sure that you're fasting on the day of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he said that fasting on the day of arafah is so virtuous that expiates your sins from last year and the year to come as well and finally, number five is whatever time you have left in the day, fill it by doing acts of good, whatever it may be, whether that's teaching knowledge, seeking knowledge, being good to your parents, reading the Quran, doing extra nufil prayers, whatever it is, just fill your time with as much goodness as possible. If you follow these five steps, I promise you, inshallah, your entire life is going to change. May Allah bless you guys.